you you call Lil B the wackest rapper ever. Yeah. And Lil B kind of took a shot at you. Yeah. So said, said you're not relevant anymore. And, but then he came back and said, shout out to Game, go buy his album. And you were like, all right, based on that, I take it back. Me, you know what I mean? You, you were like, okay, yeah. meet me and Lil B. I respect you for that. Like, <laughs> Yeah, nah, you know what, man? Lil B, you're still a whack-ass nigga. Nah, but no, check it out. Here it is, though. I was joking. Hey, no, you know what? This was this was it right here, man. Lil B called me, man, and he he was like, "Man, game, I'm a fan. I had your, you know, I had your first mixtape. I had your demo, and he got to really reciting like the lyrics and shit. And I'm like, damn, like you just never know, man. You know what I'm saying? And um, he even admitted he's like, man, I'm not no lyricist, man. I just want to fuck bitches and cook. That's it. And I'm like, yo. I respected that, you know what I'm saying? Because even B, Lil B know he not a lyricist. You know, he said that, you know, he's still trying to get better and fall in pocket and, you know, do the best that he can to be, you know, a rapper. Um, but he looked up to me, man. So, you know, I had to, you know, retract that, man, just because he was a good dude, man. So it's all love with Lil B, man. He do his thing, though. And, you know, Lil B, um, uh, you know, he'll, he'll fuck your mom, man. It's hard to be mad at someone who's not being mad back at you. Yeah, man. That's the thing, man. So, <laughs> you know, when you... Yeah. Because you, 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 you ride off that energy, but when that energy is... Okay. When that energy is not reciprocated. I mean, right. have you ever had other situations with... You know, I mean, because you, you beef with a lot of people. Have you, I mean, have you squashed with anyone except for Lil B? You know what? Currently, man, all my beefs are squashed, man. All of them. Yeah, man. Unfortunately, uh, you know what happened um, today? Um, you like our last interview, unfortunately, man. You got me in trouble with Mr. C, man. I don't, I don't, you know. And, and, and earlier, I'm um, Karen Raid who worked for Interscope. She was like, "Did you say something about Mr. C?" Or I don't remember dissing Mr. C. Like, um, no, we just talked about the facts, right? And um, but he mad at me or something, you know, for some reason. So um, I, um, that that was just crazy to me. So he was mad at me too. Yeah, but we worked it out on the phone. That's crazy. Mine didn't get worked out yet. You see. I'll reach out to him. Yeah. I'll, 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 I'll fix whatever. This is a cool guy, man. Yeah, you know he's what I'm cool. He's a legend. Yeah. You know what I mean? Life is too short to be beefing, man. Yeah, man. <laughs> Shout out to Mr. C from Game of Lab, man. <laughs> That's what it is, man. <laughs>